what these people are doing they they it's like they want to shut this video down how can they tell me um what is going on uh, let me see something okay people are still here um yes 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 Shukwe Mecca Paul, you are welcome to this wonderful broadcast. I don't know what they did. I can't even see what is going on over here. Um, Susan Adam Adane, you are welcome. Susan Adane, you are welcome. Ndu Christ, you are welcome. What is going on? They seize my viewers. They seize my viewers. I can't even see my viewers. Lasbury, Uzoma, you are welcome. Ndo Christ, once again, Collins, you are welcome. Emmanuel, you are welcome. They seize my, my, what they call it. They seize my viewers. But it's okay. It's okay. I'm going to continue because let me check if I'm already. Now, 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 it shall be fast, dear Angle Woofen. It shall be fast, Angle Woofen. shall be fast, Angle Woofen. Ella, yeah, yeah. Um, all right, wonderful people, we are there. We, we are not yet on. Um, I want to get to the platform that is available to me before I will proceed. I don't know, I don't even know what is going on right now. Um, I don't know what is going on. We are not yet in other platforms. What is going on? What is going on? Queen, you are welcome. Ostino, you are welcome. What is going on? I don't... You people should give me some just little time so that I can be able to get to other platforms before we continue because I have a lot of things to show my people. I don't care about the viewer that I'm seeing here because the viewers just stopped. The viewer stopped. I can it can even move. Jude, you are welcome. Um, let me go back again to see if I am there or not. They can do anything they want to do, but who cares? We are not there, we are not there, we are not there, we are not there. What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? Nothing is moving, nothing is moving over here. Good afternoon, Mazi Okechuku Obina Okori. Nawa Shineke. The doors are wise. Um, I'm just, just you people should give me some minutes uh, because I have to connect this thing to Biafran Television Channel One. I have to do it. And um, what is going on here? Um, yes. Uh, okay, I can see through my second. Um, um if you come here now we are having like uh 50 250 something viewers over here and here it was stopped it's only 80 viewers here but i know i know it does not matter it does not matter but i just want to make sure that i get to be a front television channel one and get to order of my platform that is most important but we are not yet there we are not yet there i don't know the reason i don't know the reason i don't know the reason i think i will also make a call what is going on here? What is going on here? Extension. Let me see extension. Maybe things have changed. Um, no, things never change. Nothing, nothing, nothing. Let me get to uh times. Collins, you are welcome. You are going home watching like a new Shuku do me. Shuku do me me. Kenneth, the doors are wise. Of course, the doors are always wise. I'm here to bring out plan B. Plan B. Uh, you see, um, what is going on? What is going on? I have to make a call. I have to make a call. What is going on? What is going on? What is going on? No, no, no. I think I have to send them. Uh, what am I? I think I have to send a message.
Hello, Mazi, what is going on? Please, I want you to reply to me straight away, please. Because over here, I don't know what is going on. If you can be able to connect it over there, please. I want you to reply to me. I know that you're busy. That's why I'm sending you this voice note, please. I want you to reply immediately, please. They will. Um, I have to go back again because, um, you know, what I'm doing, I want our people... I want our people in Piafra land to understand what I'm, I'm about to say today. Nandi, you are welcome. Chinasa, Pauline, you are welcome. Keep up the good work. Ndewo Mazi, Kingsley, you are welcome. Let me go back again to see if we have getting there because it's very, very important we get to Biafra Television Channel 1 because that is the most important so that our people will understand what I'm about to say today. Okay, I have gotten a message. I've gotten a message. Um, I've gotten a message. Oh, oh, we cannot get there. We cannot get there. We cannot. We cannot. All these things is something that... Uh, that is why, you see all this thing I'm doing here. That is why sometimes... Let me start with this. I can't get there because my ear, they have seized what I can use to get to that button. I call the technical director now. He He's at work. He has to do something for his family. But there are some people, they are there collecting money. Collecting money. They will begin to tell you. Because these people want to destroy the... The plan B that I have. And the things that I want to tell my people. Oh. 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 It's not. It's, 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 it's not. It's not a joke. This thing I'm saying is not a joke. If you people know how the media warriors are working day and night. To make sure they propagate this issue of Biafran restoration project. Why some people are there, Madam Finance is paying them. And we are here suffering. Some people will have a bad day, then we pay them money. I'm going to come there, but that is not the reason why I am. I don't want to use this as my preamble, but what happens now is why I'm feeling bad. Because now I can connect to the rest of the page that is available to me and the person that is second alternative is not there because we have been doing this for since long nobody nobody cares what we're doing madam finance went to ikech kuonoa ikech kuonoa i'm going to tell them to go and go and get their pvc they will get the pvc that is my preamble but let me tell you people what am i going to talk about today in 30 minutes time in 30 minutes time in 30 minutes time, we are going to get there and I'm going to come back again to, uh, not to come back. Um, I'm still here. But uh, I think uh, those of you that are watching me now in Rap only on Rapture Media, because where you're watching me now is only on Rapture Media. In 30 minutes time, we are going to, you know, circulate this video to other of our platform. But I will continue now. It does not matter. I will continue. I can't wait till that 30 minutes because he's busy. He cannot just left what he's doing. Why some people are there collecting money? They are collecting money, doing nothing. Ask me when last he came to Noah. When last did he came to broadcast? I don't want to go there. Uh, that is will be uh, my last article uh, to treat. Now today, great people, wonderful people, as you are joining, please don't hesitate to invite your families, your neighbors, those around you, tell them to come and listen to the plan B. I have a lot of things to discuss today. But let us start from the what we are going to talk about today. Because I want you to know what we are going to talk about today. We are going to talk about the obedient. Tinubu have emerged as a president of that contraption called Damini Buzu. But obedient, I'm still telling you people, you shouldn't lose hope. Because what God cannot do, never exists. You know, I'm just happy in what is happening today. 
My happiness is that none of them will ever say that it's IPOB. None. None. Today you can't see anybody saying that IPOB is the problem. No. They are now tackling the INEC. But let me tell you people something. I saw we are going to also talk about the, the lamentation of people. To be that people. The lamentation because they know how to lament. We saw all these people in the social media talking all sort of rubbish. Some are using these things to make money because they are all bloggers. Nobody pays me. I work every day to make sure that I put food on my table and for my family. Some people, we are, you know, and again, I'm going to tell you what the structure is. You remember when Obi started, we told them, those people, they are bloggers on social media, yapping and talking all sort of rubbish. Obi is this, Obi is this, Obi is going to bring this. We told them that the Obi has no structure. And when we are talking about structure, we are going to get there. Because when, when people are hearing structure, they think that we are talking about the population. No, that is not what structure in Nigeria is all about. And I want you people to understand this. When you are talking free and fair election, OB will win these people hands down. But because OB don't have what it takes. But they tried. What can I say? You know, in our place, whenever somebody fails, they will say, hey, but he tried. Let us put it in that way. But they have failed woefully. And my happiness today is that Nobody can ever call Mazen Namdekano and IPOB that because of you people, we lost this election. That is my happiness. You think that we don't know what we are doing? That is why you see African people, African people, they can't even reason and understand the root of their problem. If you don't know the root of your problem, that's not how you can solve it. We are going to also talk about those that owns Nigeria. Because they will never allow you. Igbo man to rule Nigeria. Oh God damn it. Igbo man. To rule Nigeria. Believe you me till that kingdom come. I go and write it down. As far as you people remain in that contraption called Damilebu Zoo. There is no how in this life that Igbo man will, will ever become. Yes, they may use some Igbo people, some willing tools from coastal region of Biafra. But those people you call, we are all Igbos, but I'm just trying to, you know, put it in a form that you will understand what I'm saying. Because now when you come, now they will be telling you only that five state is Igbo. But you have forgotten that Abreba, I don't hear, I don't know what Abreba are talking when Abreba man speaks, I don't know. When a Goyi man speaks, I don't know what he's talking about. But they are saying that they are Igbo. And our brothers from Ijona, Isoko, they are not Igbo. <laughs> you see how they are dividing us and ruling us. And that is how we are going to remain. Listen to me. I tell you people because we face reality. I face reality. I don't believe in superstitions. I don't believe that manna will fall. I don't believe in those nonsense and jargons. I don't believe. I believe in physicality, which is facing the reality. We are going to talk about destruction. We are going to talk about Mazen Nam Chukukan, what he said about the election. Because when we are saying all these things, you know, the, the, worst, the worst part of it is like, when you are telling these people all this, and they don't seem to understand, but we have, we have been witnessing these things since 1963 up to date. Up to date. Nigeria is not a country. Nigeria was formed through threat by butter. Threat by butter. Give me, make I give you. Pay me, make I return. This is it. As time was going on, they see that, what can we do? Let form this thread by butter. Let it call it a name. And one stupid idiot call for a show. Just wake up early in the morning. After God have hammered her. Oh, Piaria, Piaria from Bro 
I'm telling you the truth. You know how this life is. Oh, okay, get on your game. Or you want on a mecosia or a member of Okunutola. See, call them nigger area. After regard that is rotting today in, in his grave. He all met her for a show in the night. Oh, wake we are up. See, my, my boyfriend, we have to name these people nigger area because of the happiness in the night. He say accepted. That is how you become a Nigeria, nigger area. When you come to Germany here, that is when they will tell you the meaning of your name. Forget about all these English people that they will tell you Nigeria. No, only English people are those people that they are here, British people, to deceive you. When you go to Portuguese, when you go to Austria, when you come to Germany, when you go to France, when you go to Belgium, what they are calling you is nigger. Nigger area. Nigeria. Nigger. Only, you know, there is deception and there is deceit in this name called Nigeria. Because British people, they are the people that own that country. They don't want you to understand that you're, you are nigger. Nigger area. They don't want you. That is why they, you know, form, form it. Nigeria. Only them calls you Nigeria. Go to other countries. Those of you that are living in Belgium, I want you to tell me if I'm lying. Those of you that are living in France, I want you to tell me if I'm lying. If your name is not Nega. Nigeria, Nega. Now you understand. Go to office here in Germany now. Go to office here in Germany. As you are in Nigeria. If you tell them, if you tell them, they will ask you, where are you from? You will say, I am from Nigeria. They will say, Nigeria. Say no now. Make the push you away from that office. Oh, God damn it. We are also going to talk about Aloy Ejimako because there's a new tweet of Aloy Ejimako. You know, I don't shy away from all this nonsense. I don't. I focus always. And obedient people can never take my time. And the door is still open for them to come. But I, I will give our people also the Igbo people. Those people they are calling Igbo people. They should also calculate. And that is the plan B that I want to give them. Don't go there now. They are telling you that they want to go and do protests. One million protests. And I call it. They have started. How many people are there? I will show you people the video. They have started. I don't want you to involve in things that will take your life. Because at the end, they will call evil people. Now you understand. At the end, now you go carry out for your head. So, reason. And that is plan B. Plan B for people to be people. And we are also going to talk about the new clothes. The new photo of Mazen Namdekan. When was this photo? When, they were, when, when did they release this photo? Is it after election or before election? And what this photo stand for? We are going to discuss about it. Like I said... We are going to use it to connect the dot of this new picture and the alloy Ejimako Twitter. And the, this one ran about Master Prophet that said that Mazen Nam the Canon that he better stays in DSS dungeon. We are going to talk about we are going to begin to connect the dot from this new picture to Alloy Ejimako Twitter recently and the, the, the unfortunate in law. That said that um, a Mazen Nam the Kano is better he is in the hands of DSS than to free him to go to, to, to the wife. Because he will come and begin to say to release him to Mazichike Dozim. I begin to ask myself, is Mazichike Dozim the wife of Mazen Nam the Kano? You see, are you telling me that if you release Mazen Nam the Kano now, you will go to Mazichike Dozim or you will return to the wife? But they are telling you that it's better that Mazen Namdekano remains there. And we are going to talk about this new picture. Because people are circulating this picture. There is something about this picture. There is something about it that we are going to discuss. Because we have gotten to that level that you, you don't know anything. And I want you people to understand something. I have heard a time with that number. They will come to you. They will tell you. And they are using it to deceive other people. Then we say when Mazin Namdekano comes, he will deal with them. Listen to me. Let me tell you something you don't know. I 
have been in Ma with Mazin Namdekanu in different occasions, like European Parliament, European Union. You know, I never took picture with this Mazin Namdekanu before. I never spoke with Mazin, but I have been, I know I have saw Mazin Namdekanu live. Three times, live. When Mazin Namdekanu was calling people that you are going to listen, Mazin Namdekanu called my name more than any other person. Even though this is Billy Simon Eba you are talking about today. This Simon Eba that you people are talking about today. Go and test it. Go and confirm it from Simon. Or go back to Mazin Namdekanu videos or video. You will hear it. Broadcast. You will hear it. But I never take it upon myself like, okay, Mazin Namdekanu, let me use it. Uh, no, that is not the way it is because we are fighting for survival. That is what we're, we are fighting for survival. We are not coming here to use because Mazen Namde cannot call your name. And when Mazen Namde cannot was calling people's name, they were feeling good that Mazen Namde cannot was calling their name. Now Mazen Namde can is somewhere now. All those people that Mazen Namde cannot call their name, they are nowhere to be found. I know a lot of them today, they are not doing broadcasts again. Even though to write, when you call them, they will be telling you they have hacked my page, they have do this, some Nen Nayana is paying them. Up to date as I'm speaking to you. That is why I want you people to know this. The reason why you people never see me in this form before, when Mazi Namkan was out here, is because Mazi was out here. Things were going the way it's supposed to go. Everything that Mazin Namdekanu need to settle our people, to lobby, to meet international community, to discuss with people, things are going the way it's supposed to go. That is why you don't see me going more deeper. But now Mazin Namdekanu is not here with us. And those people that he called his, their names have to come and begin to protect the family and defend all this evil that are coming to attack Mars and Namdekano. And the more I go, the more I see more. See, the more I see some deceit from these people, especially finance. And I want you people to know this. Because some of you don't even know who I am. Some people will be saying, eh, like Mazen Namdekano, he will deal with you. So you think that Mazen Namdekano will come now and begin to kill me. Is it what you think? A whole family man. I am a family man. Catering for my family. And you are telling me that me, I am in the right track. Even though if I am not. So if they are not Mazen Namdekano, are you mad? My leader calls my name. I respect him so much. And when he started his struggle, he called people, I joined. I know the reason why some of you don't see me in this form is because Mazen Namikan was there before. But now, you people have begun to see my character the way I am. This is the way it will still remain when Mazen Namikan will come out. That is when you people will confirm that I am the way I am. The reason why I was not voicing by then is because I have nothing to say. Because Mazen Namdekan is here. He's controlling everything with the leadership. I never see him like a person like Mazishi Nasamoru complain before. I never hear Mazishi Gedosim complain before. I never heard from any none of them complain before. That is why everything, or if, if things were not going well by then, I can't say, but none of them ever complain. Do you know when last... Madam Finance stopped giving our school people something. But they are there creating their own, using our money that we, 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 we contributed. That is why I want you people to understand this. Mazen Namde cannot have found those people that he's looking for. He has found them. And I'm one of them. When Mazen Namde can call us, we are going to begin to ask a serious, a serious questions. Mazin Namdekano tell you he liked to debate. He liked a very serious argument. Not that anything that he said you will say no. Onyendu, believe you me, Onyendu have find us. When Onyendu will come out, that is when we will begin to ask all those questions. 
Because the reason why I was not, I'm just trying to tell you people, because some of you will be saying, eh, because Oyendu is not here. That is why Chukuga Abogoku, and that is when you will see, like Eze Biro, by calling a criminal police to me, a man that is in this struggle, fighting for, for survival of our people, at the same time contributing, at the same time going every uh, protection, uh, every uh, protest we have here, even though away, and now one call police for me, and one call a criminal police for me. And you're telling me that if imagine now they cannot come out, he will tell us to forget about it. No, we can never forget about all those things. No, it can't be possible now. It can't be possible now. Like this question I'm keep on asking. Why is the Bureau knows that our leader was on Mountain 80? You think I will stop it? I will not. You see all these things that Madam Finance is doing today. Do you think that I will stop it by disobeying in subordination to this struggle to Mazichi Kedosium? You think I will stop it? That is when you will know that Biafran Child watch naked. Is a man of his own word, and I'm not hero worshiper. Mazin Namikan, we love him so much. We love the ideology that he brought to us. And the Mazin Namikan knows that he cannot do this thing alone. He knows that is why he was calling people. That is why he called this Abelima called Simon because he was doing exposition by then. Mazin Namikan said, Yes, this guy uh, he's doing yeah, he knew dimension, and now he entered his head. When Mazen Namikan was calling people, he can also enter my head. Because some of you people don't know what or those that have came to me. But I'm standing firm because we have one life. Tomorrow, I may die. They will put me only this shirt. Now you understand. Uh, I have a lot of voice. So we are going to talk about this clothes of Mazen Namikan. They bring out these two pictures. We are going to talk about is this picture before the election and I will connect the dot. This is it. We are going to talk about why we said we IPOB from the leadership because we are following every structure of this movement. Okay. Let me see if we have already getting there. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. But let me just check. I'm just giving you preamble. I never even introduced myself, but I'm telling you people what we're going to discuss today. Um, this is it. And we are not going to run away from all these things. We are not uh, even there. We are not even there. But it's okay. Even there, it's not okay. It's okay. This is what we are facing every day. This is what we are facing every single day that uh, Madam Finance will be there paying some people and uh, do you know that Madam Finance came out again? Madam Finance said that we, we are uh, Richard Card Media Warriors on Facebook. And uh, she had forgotten that Bia Franchise Wachi Neke Mazo no Kichukun sign a code of conduct. She had forgotten. An old, I don't know what to call it, Nanyu Shigama Mayasu. She do not even understand. We are in the same unit. I am in the same meeting with this Madam Finance. But the first time he saw me, I don't know what they are thinking about me. Even though there is a time they call me even Sabu, because the way I was coming to the meeting, I was not under political asylum. I have my document. I'm doing well with my dressing and sometimes, because they will begin to see how come, how they don't know that we, I want to live my life because I know that we have one life. And I, before I will continue, that advice I want to give you people, some of you that are living in Europe, stay in one place, walking from year to year, taking your money to that contraption while you are living in Europe. Believe you me, you are a very stupid, you are a very, very stupid human being. Or some of you that are in Europe, working day and night, packing money for your kids, you are stupid. You are very, very stupid. So you will work, keep the money for your kids. They will grow 
and begin to eat the money. You must be stupid. When you make your money, I will tell you, buy what you want. Spend even those 70% out of that your money with your kids. Keep only 10% for them. Especially in Europe, that they have a work. What I'm doing, my kids, when they grow, they will start, for, they will start their life now. So you, you think that I will go and work and keep money for them. Why there is a work here? That is exactly what we are planning for Biafra. So that when you, when, when you come or when you, as a man, you work for yourself and enjoy. When, you're, when you have your kid, your kid will begin to work for himself or herself. This is the way it is. But let me continue. All right, so this is what we have today. Uh, let me introduce myself to my audience. Then I will move forward to, to show our people what I have today because we are going to connect the dots. There is no two ways about it. I don't even know what is happening. I don't know what is happening. I can't even see comments. I can we have already we have already used 30 minutes now. Ma, say, I want you haven't finished. We have you have I have already used 30 minutes now. You told me 30 minutes that you are going to be free. But uh, what can I do? I can't do anything because I don't know where you are. I don't know where you are. We never come, we are not in Biafran television, we are not in a uh, time, we are not in Echo, we are not in Washineke. We are no, we are not no, we are nowhere. We are nowhere. It's a pity, it's a pity. It's a pity that some people are there collecting money. We are here working. It's very, very pity. But now, let me let me introduce myself. Let me move forward. It does not matter. It does not matter. I don't know how many viewers we have. They, they are showing me here 84, but it does not matter. You think I come here to look at anybody's face? Um, let me go to my what I have for my people today. But let me introduce myself first before I move forward. All right, wonderful people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. You are welcome once again on Rapture Media now under the leadership of Mazin Namdi Okuchukukano. Eba no, we set the record straight. I am from Ihala in Anambra. Anambra in Biafra land. I am IPOB on the chain of command. Like I always tell my people. And it's authentic. And nobody can ever change it. Mazen Nandoku Chukukano is the leader of indigenous people of Biafra. The director of Radio Biafra. The highest commander of this movement on absence of Mazin Namdekan, Mazi Shiki, Dozim is the one in charge. And everything that he says goes. Anything that he authenticates stands. Every of his word stands. This man, no, 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 a criminal. You are forging, you are forging, you are forging signature. Now you have turned to a Benima. You have turned to Simon that is forging signature of the of the president in a, in a, in Finland. That is what the, this idiot I will bring uh, very very soon. Now you know how I do my own now. Very very soon nobody will know about you. You are there working with work, working with Luciferia. Now you are out. You are forging somebody's signature. You are forging Mazishike Dozem signature. A coordinator in Italy. A very stupid and non-entity. Gaga ga, 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 He did not went to school. I want to bring that idiot. A former one. Like we have already have the authentic one. And I will bring them soon. They are going to come. That is how we will do our own. We are going to make them. People will know them. You that are gone, you are gone. You know we have the platform. You know that. And this platform you see we have. We build it on our own. But you will see them, they will be there saying, eh, eh, they have platform, but you can build your own platform, isn't it? Madam Finance and Anishiyama Meneazo, with Ikesh Kuono Ana Kogo, that it's been a long time he ever come to our uh, to broadcast for us. 
Now they are doing Facebook thing now. But the same Madam Finance we are saying before, eh, leave them. They are on Facebook. They don't know what they are doing. Eh, you just leave them. But now they have come back to Facebook. And the is there. I, 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 will, I one day, I will bring a voice note of Ike Shukunua. You people will see how Ike Shukunua was. He was insulting me. He who be a friend child. And when this guy was insulting me, I just, I sent this thing to Rapture Media Technical Director. I say, Mazi, could you imagine that this Nunen Titina, a 70 years old man of Sinia law, insulting a family man that can, can, that can give him a letter of invitation. All this in honor of I will give him a letter of invitation. He will go to, 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 to this thing. They will give him a visa. I, I can give anybody, but you don't think that if you come here ask me, I'm not doing any, but I'm just trying to tell you what I can do. He was insulting me, telling me that it's only Mazi or former. Chukuma or former, yeah? It's only person that he, today he was, he gets Kuono her was with Inem Nayana under their street, uh, street light. Nebana who cut him. That's not street beat, because not street light. Ever now, who got it? A whole Madam Finance, a whole worldwide finance was on broadcast. They couldn't even get 84 people. I'm getting 84 people here because that is what I'm saying. They couldn't even get 84 people. They are getting 25. A whole Madam Finance. But when we are telling them that we are working, people are listening to us. They don't even want to listen, they don't even want to hear. I use my time to come here to educate our people at the same time, learn from our people. But they don't care. Madam Finance will be telling you, what are you people are doing? I've been in exile for years now. I can't even travel. Now, Tinubu have entered another story. But one thing I want you people to know, some of you that are in Biafra land, we will keep on being in exile. Some of you that are daft in school that don't want to listen. We will keep on being in exile and you people will keep on suffering in that contraption. Evil man becoming a president of Nigeria. Impossible. It can never happen. Go and write it down. Go and write it down. I don't say what I I don't say what I don't know. Structure, we are going to talk about it now. I want to use this as a preamble. I want you people to see this. Amodu Bello. Amodu Bello. I'm going to read it out. And that to show you there is no how in this life an Igbo man can ever become Nigerian president. And you will remain slave forever if you think that uh, uh, you don't know this thing. Uh, let me come, my people. Let me, my people. Let me come. Oh, uh, yes. Yes. Okay. Okay. So, um, nah, man. So, this is it here. This is it here. I read, I read, I read. I want you people to pay attention. The new nation called Nigeria should be an ex-state of our great-grandfather, Usman Danfodil. We must ruthlessly prevent a change of power. We use the minority of the North as a willing tools and the South as a conquered territory and never allow them to rule over us and never allow them to have a control over their future. In an if and a why, a Igbo man, as he have to know, because he has to know, an Igbo man, they are telling you to come out from the life. They say, nah, I say. now let us see what Mazen Nambekano said before we go to, like, to the lamentation, because there are many here. Um... I want you people to listen to this voice of Mazin Namdekano. This is only INEC that decides the 
results of elections in Nigeria, not your PVC. The sooner you understand this, the better for you. Are you listening what he said? Only INEC. Let me repeat it again so you will hear. And the what Mazin Nandekano said, when they start leaking, whenever you see them start rigging, that is when you know, say, <laughs> these people are a bunch of idiots. Oh, my people. We have suffered. We have suffered. Obedient, where are you people today? You people don't know anything. Okay, let us hear what Onyendu said here. Let us hear what Onyendu said here. Pay attention now, my people. When they start rigging the election, oh yeah, they are, they are beyond redemption. Oh. It is only INEC that decides the results of elections in Nigeria, not your PTC. The sooner you understand this, the better for you. Now you're on. Once there's a delay, you know it's making. What that's all of you kept quiet. You did nothing. Yes. And you're looking for good plan. I can't do bothered with these people because they are not really relevant. They are they are beyond redemption. Do you people are worried? It is only I make that decides the You know, in our land, in Biafra land, when they were doing this election. They were counting it straight away. And the Ugua Osan, did they count it? The answer is no. Because they are about to rig the election. I want you people to pay attention again to Onyendu because we are going to use Onyendu as a preamble. Then you understand what Onyendu told us. And there is a plan B. Now listen. So tagging those that claim that the international community to see the nonsense happening in the zoo and tell me on what grounds this very election should be allowed to stand. Given the gravity of what transpired on Saturday across the entire city. Please, I want to do that right now. So the world may know. If you go to my page, this is very simple, Mazen I'm sure very soon you will form another one. Mazen Nam the Kanu. You will see it there. You will see it. All these facts are there and figures. So you can tell, uh, maybe educate yourself and also your children. They are talking about the place they call Nigeria as their country. Yes. It's, it's a country full of animals, I'm telling full you. Full of animals. Man, man. Um, um, man, 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 not just sitting down, what I saw kneeling down. You cannot see from the top of Mount Everest. An elder who cannot see what's about to happen is not an elder. This thing happened today, the last thing was going to happen. It was supposed to happen. You're dealing with Alamanji, they didn't go to school, there was no way result. result. Jupiter doesn't have way result. We had it before he died, no way result. The law specifically states that you must have a work result to contest. And who make it? But had none. Do you know who defended Bukhari? Who? Baba Sancho. Stop it. Slowly, he went to Mom. Hold on, hold on. You, have you people forgotten my last broadcast? When I was telling Baba Sancho with nonsense article he wrote, we are saying that uh, this time around they are not going to leave Obi. I told Baba Sancho, stop deceiving our people. They brought Baba Sancho to our people to calm them down. You know, our people, that is how we, we rate elders. Especially those people who have been in government. We rate them that they know better. I told you people that Obasanjo is a double agent. Now Obasanjo go and join P2P so that let them be doing what they are doing. And now a lot of people come on blogging saying, hey, Obi is taking the power. And now Kogiri on internet. Obi has no structure. Do you know what is structure? Go back to your census. Go to your lawmakers. Go to your local governments. Go to your states. So what I'm saying in a sense is that 
How many states do you have? How many local governments do you have? How many lawmakers do you have? How many registrations do you have? How many people in power do you have? Mazi have told us only Kaduna have covered the whole so called eastern region of PF. Only one state in northern part of Nigeria. So, how do you think you can win them? How? We allow obedient people with P to B, OB is a boy, to go out there so that they will come back because they never hear. OB want to go to court. They say maybe probably Obasanjo is running around saying they will go to court. Otu Abunis didn't Atiku go to court. But that their one is full and to full and Is it not the same court they release him as in America? They stay there. He <laughs> want to go to court. You a buffoon, idiot, Karoma. Let us continue. So military academy. Because of that, uh, how can you say he doesn't have work? That's it, man. Baboons in the zoo everywhere. Baboons in the zoo. Don't you throw? I'm metaphoric. They were arguing an election should not cause life of citizens. This is a broad election. They're asking, can we get a threat? How can we get a threat to an animal in the zoo? How, can, how is that possible? There is a zoo animal. The picture is the same everywhere you go to. Somebody said that, um, you know, I saw to Secondus. Yes. He was wearing, is it Kastan and Kundia uh, Wasa? And I'm thinking, does he want them to feel sorry for him and give him more votes or what? It doesn't matter how you dress in your abada, in your kaftan, it doesn't matter. in your Kundia Wasa. It doesn't matter. Wasa cap. It doesn't matter. It doesn't you will still be used for sacrifice whenever the coming. time comes. They are coming. You can dress as a Yoruba man all you like, they'll never love you. You can dress an Awasa man from yeah, here to eternity never. and nobody will give a damn about you. Not just, time for sleep. just imagine. You know, when I'm saying all these things, people don't seem to understand what I'm saying. I will be shipping something through this, our, our leader's voice. A Yoruba man can never love you. That is for sure. I'm not saying, I mean, the common Yorubas. Or the common Igbo man or the common houses, they may love each other as a people. But when you come, because when we are saying loving each other, we are talking about the, the government. We are not talking about common people, like person like me. No, that is not what we are talking. And where that love is from is from the leaders. If the leaders can be able to love themselves, that is when things will be moving forward. I keep on telling my people. The reason why you are seeing all these shenanigans parading every single day happening because we are not one people. You, see, you we saw somebody in Lagos, Koro Koro, telling you that if you vote, you Igbo man, he will do something. He will deal with you. Can he say some, something like that to a Yoruba man? The answer is no, because they are one. Now you understand. Imagine a a a, a so called contraption. That is now existing for almost 63. I don't know how many years. A so he called Igbo man. I will tell him, go away. It's not going to help you. You say we are one people. You now you don't want to allow them to get to that seat. And I'm telling you, you can never get there. There is no how in this life. Igbo man can never be a Nigerian person. You so you want to, you want these people to go against. They are great grandfathers or the words of Amodu Belu. Is it what you are telling them? You see, let me tell you people something. Our people are so gullible because they use Christianity to bamboozle our minds. I will tell you the truth. If we are Fulanese, Occupying that space we have in only that five states they are talking about. They could have got this Biafra for a long time. I don't lie. I'm telling you the truth. I know that some, some of you won't, you know, you won't, you don't want me to say something like that, but we are facing reality. If it's full of me that have only that five states you are talking about, 
and they have these resources, listen to me, they will go for a long time. They will collect everything, go. And you can never do anything. Because they have used Christianity to bamboozle our mind that the manna will fall from heaven. That is a deceit. And I want our people to turn back from that. It's not going to help you. I have a lot of videos of people praying, making incantation against the noble. You are very stupid. If it's just your incantation or spiritual is working, he could have killed Tinubu before he became a president. Now that he's a president already, you want to kill him. You're a very stupid idiot. I saw a woman that brought out his son because the woman wants to make viewers. The son knew him that said, you put out a Kriopu story. Idiot. You think that this is the way they are living here in Europe? No, that is not the way. They don't pray like that. They don't make any incantation. They go for it physical, life and direct. We saw how what happened in, is, is in Malaysia when people take over the street. You don't see it. It's physical. They believe in reality. They face reality. Your own you will be calling. Hey, God, hey, if his obey doesn't win, I don't trust you again. You're a madman. So you think that God will, will bring manna from heaven or you are going to implement that manna to begin to work physical. We told you people will be is going nowhere. We allow them to go there and vote so that it will happen in their eyes. Koro, koro. Can you tell me what Eberima is saying today? Eberima to return on Friday to police station. We never stop. Eberima killed a pregnant woman. We never stop there. Now you understand what I'm saying? Let us continue. Our comes to slaughter you as they have shown me time and time again. I remember when I used to preach, yes. they called it a hate speech. So. A Fulani soldier coming to our land and killing people during election day is a love bullet. It's a love bullet. When they, when they attack IBOB during our peaceful release, it is a um, love, um, love killing. You can now see the way they are. You can see them for what they are. Hypocrites. Everyone. You can see how evil they are. They oh. are evil. And I said to them before. Yes. What an evil man was the Anik German. He introduced option, is it A4, they call it. Yes. Come outside and kill behind whoever you're supporting. As a letter, that was very easy. A letter to very easy to determine or to discern who the winner is. They said, no, the world has moved forward. Let us go with technology. I said, you are talking about technology in a country where you have no light. No light, no water. No we are almost no, everybody's a criminal. No hospital. You see two out. How can you run an electronic election when you have no electricity. How is that possible? They said that the world has moved, you know, you know, when you argue with a typical useless Nigerian, and that's how they go. Oh, the world has moved on. We're in this age. After all, my my Chinese phone is working. I'm online. And the, you know this thing that Tony is saying now. You know, there is something about African people. When African man is using iPhone, latest iPhone, they will be thinking that they have already integrated or they have already been civilized. No, that is not me. That is not civilization. If I tell you people, I think it wasn't Obasanjo, ITT, Obasanjo and uh, is it uh, Abiola, ITT, International Thief Thief. Do you know that Nigerian people were already in a line to begin to install telephone before Greek people. Do you know that? They are telling you that civilization comes from Greece. But do you know that Nigerian people started installing telephone, this one land telephone that they are putting on the phone, before Greek people? Of course, they did not install it. They stole the money. That is when Fela said, ITT, International Thief Thief. They did not. But that is why I want to differentiate civilization and all this technology. Being you using a latest technology, that does not mean that you are civilized. No. No. When you are talking about civilization, civilization is that whatever you are doing, you must abide with the rule of the land. Law is, ab you are not above the law. What you will do to A is exactly what you are going to do to B. 
if you are saying you are one people as in Nigeria as they are today, you are not going to base on tribalism. You base on capacity. What this man can offer. Can he help this country to grow? This is it. A Yoruba man may be there for eternity as things are moving forward. And how someone can be there because if I call Ibo man, they will turn it around now. Let me be giving you up. And how someone can be ruling from eternity as far as things are going the way it's supposed to go. Not tribalism. Ah, this is not my people. Hey, this is how we get them. They, this one, our own. Yeah, 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 yeah. Have you people forgotten what uh, Tinubu said? He say if you don't work hard, that Igbo will then we keep on marginalizing Igbo. Now he have become there, and I want you people to know that what is about to come, you people will hear them. Plan B, you people will hear them. Remember that the whole vote, they voted, they were counting it, they were counting it. Ob. To Obi, you think that Tinubu is not taking record? When Tinubu will go back to Anambra, because you people are so stupid, you people are daft in school, that you can't even keep secret as Fulani are doing, everybody are doing. No, we want to show ourselves. By that counting, it will also end like Bugari. Bugari said 95.15, it will also end there. Tinubu have said it already. And Tinubu have confirmed that all of you people vote for Peter Obi. When I go suffer. They never come. But there is a plan B, like I said. Let us finish on you. So because your Chinese phone is working, you think you've arrived. And you think you have what it takes yeah, man, now. to be able to contribute towards any form of debate at all. That could advance the well-being of the internet. Look at my phone. I'm using my second phone is Huawei. Not that I don't have money to buy iPhone, the latest one. Not. But for me, it just it just just like that. But you will go to Nigeria today. You can see a young kid of let me say 20 years or 25 years. He can't even buy a good clothes. You will see him wear a tata trouser, but the person will be using a latest iPhone. The person will be using latest iPhone because he think that she or he have arrived by using the highest iPhone. But me, that can feed you for complete five years without stopping, take you to school, couldn't even use iPhone because we know that in Europe we know that phone is nothing because. Phone is not achievement. To use a phone is not achievement. But we, remember that I went to Nigeria when last, I don't know, been a long time. I saw a guy. When I was there, uh, I don't know which phone I was using by then. I saw a guy with latest iPhone double. A very tattered person, they carry it. And when they will carry it, they will carry it on their hand like this double. They want you to see it all. Oh. You see how stupid our people is. You see the investment of our people. You will carry iPhone, double iPhone, iPhone 27, iPhone 30. You carry it on your hand because you want people to see that you have iPhone. Now you call it investment. Do you know that here we are today? A 10 years old uh, Pekin, a 15 years old Pekin, their parent can buy the person iPhone, the latest iPhone. So that they can begin to use it to communicate with the parent. Phone is nothing. It's not a civilization. You are using a flat screen. It's not a civilization. When I went to also in that contraption, I saw a lot of people saying eh, flat screen. But in Greek, when I was there, because I was traveling every year from Greek, we are when I went to that contraption, when people are shouting about flat screen, we in Greece are still using a old television. But now they are telling you it's a new one. It's a civilization. A very stupid and unhinged people that never reason and understand the way life is supposed to go. If you have a good water, if you have a very good environment, you have hospital, you have factory where people can go and work you have a sound judiciary 
where the court will give order, they will obey it. That is what they call civilization. All these things that I mentioned to you. Not phone, not car. People are pressing my door wall. So let me finish Onyendu. Or let me go to other people. We come back to Onyendu back. Vohin, Vohin. Then the brother is on Tavex. It's a hotel. Yeah, there is Shuvek. Come to Hotel? Nah. Then come there. It's rest. Yeah, Uba Morgan. Just one minute, my people. Let me continue. My son just go. Hello, hello, citizens. My son just come back from school, and uh, you know, I have, of course, I have to pay attention to my son. Nobody pays me. Uh, why, Madam Finance is there paying everybody every day? You know, so we have, uh, we are doing what we have to do to survive, and we don't care about what people are saying. You know, we don't care. Um, we have already, I think, uh, let me check if we have getting to Biafran Television. I think we are there already. We are there. We are there. We are not on Biafran Television. Why? We are not on I'm not on. It's okay. Let me continue. Let me continue. It doesn't matter. I'm seeing 84 here. It's okay. Let me continue. Am I, uh, Biafran Chinese name is speak or you do this struggle new. Why are you looking at, uh, uh, what they call it? You are looking viewers. 84 is enough here. It doesn't matter. We, we, we know what we are doing. And by the end of the day, people will watch it. Let me show you people something. Let me show you people something. When I know this idiot they call Raka. Oh, that is why I'm telling you our problem is a primitive life. We are still in dark ages. We don't know the ethics of this movement or this life at all. But I know, okay, let me, let me, yeah. Eh, Mas Nasu na Nasu 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 Udo 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 Nasu. Thank you. But uh, Mas, am I in Biafran Television? I don't think so. If I am, yeah. Mas, let me continue. It doesn't matter. Eighty-four, eighty-four viewers, eighty-four viewers. That is what I'm seeing here. It does not matter who likes. We are doing well, Mas. Eh, Mas, I do understand. Okay, good, good, Mas. Let me continue. There, thank you. Thank you. All right. So, um. You see, that is why I want you people to understand something. I want you people to understand something. Mazi Jude say we are now 700 and uh, it won. Some people say told me that we have already getting to 1,000 and uh, you know Facebook, they will take on suppressing us. It does not matter. You know, uh, I am a kind of person that I have already have a safer landing. When you are talking about Facebook, I have a safer landing. I have been here for years. I have been propagating this issue. Mazi called my name here and there. So you don't know. Eberima Simon able to return to police station on Friday. We keep on coupling things that we need to nail that guy. He's not talking again today. Nigerian people. I want to show you people Oraka. Oraka. Or, do you know this Oraka you are seeing? I never finished about the video. The new picture of Onyendu. I will also take you back also again to 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 what they call it to um a new picture of Onyendu and our lawyer Jima call latest Twitter and uh, I will also take you also back again to the broadcast of uh, what they call it Ike Shukwono Hana Kwasre. Ah, uh, my son, please close the door. The, the, the. Nah, yeah. I'm going to see Avatar like this. Nah, 
Oh, okay, Jim Wakambo. I may, I may, I may, I may, I may, I may, Father. And some idiot will come to me and tell me that if only do come at only do we deal with you. A mad people everywhere. A whole grown up man. A whole a father that control his family. He now has seven only do put only do we deal with you. Like I'm a kid. Like only do guy people mortally. This is bureau no ever now see And this bureau is using this thing to deceive them. Finance is using this thing to deceive them. Hey, continue what you are doing. When only do come, only do we do them something. What do you think only do we do to us? What do you think? What do you think? You think that I'm happy? Oh, am I? Okay, they are calling me. Hello? Mazi, I know what I'm, I know. I know what I know. I know what this is. You know, we, I will talk to you later. I will talk to you. I understand what you're saying, Mazi. They will. Then we tell you, Onyendu, we deal with you. When Onyendu was calling people's name, did they tell Onyendu to call my name? The answer is no. Onyendu called my name due to what I'm doing to the extent that Onyendu said, the Bia franchise, the Wachineke, Onyohoma. He added Onyohoma to my name. But that he believed, he said, don't let devil enter you. He believed, today, where is he? Let me continue to what I'm saying. I want you to hear the lamentation of uh, obedient people, the stupidity of uh, Nigerian people, those people that are believing one Nigeria, we are telling them, come back. Obi Igbo man, they are telling him, come out from the fire. The fire will burn you. Obi said, no, I want to enter inside fire. Why Obi knows that they don't have any structure like i said structure is how many local government do you have structure is how many state did they give to you structure is what is the census structure is how many lawmakers do you have in your place now you understand obi has all this uh, obi is going nowhere we know but when you come in reality, because we are facing reality, Obi win these people hands down. But I'm telling you, Igbo man can never become a president of Nigeria. Igbo man can never become. Just write it down. Write it down where I'm saying it. Igbo man can never become. As this election is finishing after eight years of Tinubu, a full animal man is coming. Write it down. But by, by that time, we have getting our, our Biafra. No, 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 don't call me from this phone. I think you have to come here. No, 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 no. Um, I want to tell you the lamentation of obedient people. When we are telling them, there is one man they call Oraka. Nah, eh. Okay, we have come back again. I don't know. I'm seeing the, I think I'm seeing the, 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 Chuku, Emeka Paul, the doors are wise. Of course, just be writing the doors are wise. We know what we are doing. We are ahead of these people. We are ahead of them. That is why Mazen Nandekanu lifted the election boycott of election, not to stop election, but boycott. He lifted it because our people, their sense is not working. We have the our people, they they, they lack ability. They they can't raise. That is why they are using them to them. Oh, you just want to say, the general, big guy. Of course, I am a big guy. Thank you, Mars. And I will deal with them, one after the other. I will deal with them. Simon Eber to return to police station on Friday. Nen Nayanya to change our national account. Ike Chukwonoha to run away from Radio Biafra and now go to street, uh, street beat. I mean, it's not street beat because it's not street uh, hanging of cotton. I don't know what they call it. We are going to discuss about all these things today. But let me address P2B people. Because there is a plan B for P2B people. There is a plan B. If only they can learn and understand. And I will tell you people, do you call yourself as an Igbo man living in Abuja, as an Igbo man living in Lagos, they call you now to come, let us go and protest. Let us listen to me, don't listen to them. All. Because at the end, they will say, Naibo man, have you forgotten what happened in Ensas? These people cannot withstand answers. <laughs> now it's an election. You know how these people, you know how Nigerian works. Nigeria have understand that the youths are useless. I, I will put it up. Say I have Oraka here. You will see the same Oraka 
came as an ecostan region our brother i can't deny him oraka is my brother from coastal region you know that is where we do our things you think that we will come here like people think that you think i will deny p2b that p2b is not my brother p2b is my brother p2b is like my like my elder brother because p2b cannot be my father because i don't think he, he can never have a, a son like me Na eh, onye ma bi anu here na you boss na the phone na but anu here please. Na eh, you know, Peter Obi is my brother. I won't deny him. Oraka is my brother. I won't deny him. But the stupidity in these people is something I don't even understand. Now you understand what I'm talking about. That is why I can't stop. Because I'm always paranoid about these people. The way election goes in Nigeria is this. Forget about this lamentation, people saying they are going to pick up people. Nah, man. Man. Ella, Ella, Ella. Who is it? Who is it? a lot of language. I speak Greek. I speak uh, German. A little bit English. I, Igbo is my, my mother tongue now. Hebrew. Now you understand. So let me continue where I start. It's very, very import, important you always understand the root of your problem. You see, let me tell you how things work in that contraption. That is why you see whenever election comes, they will do the election. Now they will force them to announce the election. You see all these things people are doing now. Tinubu is your president. Believe you me, there is no and I have told you people. Junkies will be many more. A transaction of a high drugs will be day by day activities and it will never change. And the 419 will be the option. They are, they are plan A. 419 will be the plan A. You remember during the time they are telling you about Babangida? That one will be different. This time around it will be open. And if you people don't take time, they will ban. I will tell you the observers. I have everything. Let us talk about Oraka. Oraka is my brother, like I said. I won't deny him. But the stupidity in him and the idiocy in him cannot allow him to understand that he is a mess. We brought this man to IPOP as our brother from coastal region because you know sometimes that is why you see Tamil Tami Neri because we want everybody to be in this family a lot of people will tell you you why you don't why you don't want to involve the coastal regions let me tell you something you know uh, they have killed our people so much especially those so called Igbo speaking Biafra we are all Igbos but that is where they are using us Dividing us and ruling us. The day that we will understand that we are all Igbos, that is when they will kill people in hinterland, you will understand that they are killing your brother. But still, up to date, they don't understand that. And we are trying to make it the way people will understand it. That is why you see a Tamineri that is not qualified to be an African rep. They put him there because they always want peace to reign. So that we will see, we say that everybody is inclusive. And they said inclusive. 
They are stabbing us at the back. They are stabbing us. Oraka came as a person that, uh, you know, Oraka is a talkative now. You know how to talk. And some of our people, they always trying to go to those people that are speak BB grammars. Oraka or like to speak all this copy and paste. They say he have arrived. We brought this idiot to this trouble. He don't reach one, one week. He begin to say, I have to be here. A, 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 a organization that have been running for over, <clears throat> over seven years. It just enter. You want to know everything from beginning. That is why I'm telling the obedient before Chukua Bonoko. As you people are coming, we are going to sanitize all of you and make scream. say, hey, I want to be this. And all these things that you people are saying. You see all these things that that's why I'm trying to tell you people when only do come things we change. I'm not a follow follow freedom fighter and I'm not a hero worshiper. I am a father that takes care of his family. Now you understand what I'm saying. So I do everything the way I see that is right. Not when you come. I'm coming to plan B. I never get there. Because I will give you people option. And it will help you people. But if you are waiting for Igbo man, this five state, to become a president of Nigeria, you are a madman. You are an idiot. You are an idiot. Igbo man to come and rule them. You want them to give him P2B? Then we say you P2B, we give them Piafra. Of course, P2B is not part of all. P2B is one Nigeria. That is their thinking. And because they know that we are a, product, a productive people. They know. They don't want us to go away. They want to keep us down. Oraka came. We opened up Oraka. Things were going well. Because Biafran people, especially those called Igbo speaking Biafra, that five states, we so much want Biafra to come today, come tomorrow. Our brother from coastal region, Oraka, my brother, he joined. Our people begin to send money to these idiots. Send the money to him to make him feel happy. That is why you see most of this, our brother from coastal region. I don't know why does it mean that these people are doing this thing, thinking that they are helping us to actually, to restore Biafra, that Biafra is our own. That is exactly what Oraka did. And Tamineri still come and begin to do the same thing. Give me this, give me that. So you are not qualified to be African rep. So you don't have a job to be African rep. And you want them to give you African rep. Italian national, former national coordinator go and use uh, our Mazichike, the same signature. A criminal. This is a, a high profile criminal. I should give him. I'm going to go to the boy. Idiot. What's your rack? Where is lamenting? After we are going to win, and I go with and I go, we are going to do this. We'll be there to be that. We'll be in co, be in car, and I can no sense. You oraka come and look at a, a nonsensical oraka, an idiot. He's my brother, of course, he's my brother. Am I not? Am I going to deny him the answer? Is no. But oraka is a definition of stupidity. Oraka is a definition of stupidity. Now watch what he's talking about. I don't know how this man think that he can win, or he can win in that contraption. I just think you go that we have removed our hand. Thank God, that is why I said, give us Biafra. We are going to worship you in truth and honesty. We are not going to have any other God beside you. Just give us Biafra. And all this Ndioshi na wokite. All this Giana Bia. Obi Osnaf again as now. And can can I mean Holy Ghost Ministry? We are going to chase all of them away from our land. If you have a church, you begin to pay tax. There's no ways about it. If you say church will be your company or your day day to day activities, where your money you must be paying tax the, the way they are doing it here. That is what we're saying. 
If you do it, you must pay tax. And we are making them poor. They feel they may be feminine. They gang gang. That is why we say when Biafra comes, you can worship whatever you want to worship in your life, but the law of the land will supersede everything. If you go against it, you shall be fair. Not like in the zoo today, that you know that Inubu is a criminal, a Parkinson man, and you are putting him there to rule you. Beat, beat, both beat opio, both Atiku, both uh, Tinubu, nobody qualified to be there. The qualification of that contraption is division. Cease Nigeria to exist. Cease Nigeria to exist. Disintegration of that contraption. That is the solution. There is not always about it. Now you understand. Let us listen to Oraka, my brother. A stupid, a, a stupid man. My name is Magnus. Magnus Oraka. Uh, right I... now, I'm a very, very wounded person. Hey! In fact, this country they call Nigeria is rubbish. This... Oraka said, this country called Nigeria is a rubbish. Do you know that this idiot called Oraka, when he joined IPOB, we told him this. He knows this. Now he begins to lament. I will give them plan B. Forget about lamentation. It's not going to help you at all. Lament from now to thy kingdom. It's not, Tinubu is already your president. And there is no how you can change it. Take them to court. You will wait till thy kingdom come. You are not going to change anything. That is why when the election happens in Nigeria, what they are forcing people to do, the INEC, is just to announce it. Announce it and forget what we, we, we come after it. Who are you? Nigerians youth are, you know, I don't blame them. We are going to listen to Iraq. I don't blame Nigerian youths because Nigeria is not, you don't want dying for. You know the reason why? We are not one people. When this protest will start now, they will tell you it's an evil man that is causing the problem. At the end now, they will bring some hoodlum from Yoruba land and from Fulani to counter them. At the end, they will tell you it's a, it's a hoodlum versus hoodlum. Now they will deploy military to begin to kill them. When they kill two or three people, the fight has ended. Tinubu will continue. You see how they roll. Now you understand how they are. Are you getting the point how they are roll? That is why you have to come back. We IPOB are going to accept you people. Iberimana, can you tell me? Iberimana, money have entered. And I want you people to go back to Simon Iberimana. I have to go to police station on Friday. We are coming there. Tell him now that our people vote in Biafra land for P2P. What is the next step? He said that our people will not vote. If our people not vote, we don't know what is going to come. Now that our people have vote, vote, and begin to understand that Nigeria can never work. What is the takes of Simon Eber on this issue now? If we stop these people by today, they are not going to be calling INEC. Every gutter Yoruba media in that contraption will be calling IPOB. Mazen Nandekano. IPOB. Mazen Nandekano. This is Mazen Nandekano self. This man self will do your own tumor. This man self will remain there. This man, I hope they go to our academy to Mazi Kehafia. Mazi Metusela. He said, Why they did not kill him at Faruku Ibeko? A man that's supposed to be giving you people now encouragement what to do that is the reason why they keep on keep that is the reason why they kept mass in Nandi, Canada, or they kept him there to remain there till their vote will finish because they know that they are going to rig the election they know that p2b can never come there even though a person don't have Bagali, he can never come. i will bring this charlie boy idiot let us finish this now i've talking to i talked too much let us listen to it three minutes we are going to finish watching it hello my name is magnus magnus raka Right now, I'm a very, very wounded person now. In fact, this country they call Nigeria is rubbish. Okay. This is the most useless country that my papa and mama born me inside. You mean I'm? Um, useless country. Oraka. 
most useless, useless country. I don't know. But a few people make this country they're useless. Yeah. Very, very useless. So you know. Plateau result. Eh, yeah. what happened? Plateau result where Peter will be sweep. Uh -huh. And what? Where Peter will be sweep. Now they don't say, eh, Labour Party, 460,000 APC. That means Peter will be manage win. That's a big lie. But that is the structure they are telling you now. Einek. Einek. Coconut. Co coconut. I'm going to call you now two times. We can add one, make it be three. Yes. Einek. Yes. Okay. We'll come burn the office down. Shut up, man. Forget away. Yes, yes. Oh, Police, like, I, mean, I, I hate this people. I hate this fashion. I don't buy my trash, so I go take sleep for he any said, prison. I'm telling you, it's like. When I sell, prison sell, open <laughs> are very big. Because the people you go arrest, they go plenty. People you go arrest, they go plenty. Plateau Resort, yes. 4.2 million, they go reduce that to 400,000. A whole 800,000, they cut and come out. Yeah, that is right. your lamentation. Yes, it will be wind with a just small. Uh -huh. And what are, what, are what are you going to do? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? They don't, they don't, they don't. Uh, this polling unit here. Yeah, what happened? This place, Sean. This place, now polling unit. Go and ask them. Go and ask them. This is lament. One, uh, is, this is not about asking. This is a stupid oracle. No. Now one. Twenty-seven. Twenty-seven. Okay. PDP. Thirty-six. And then. Five hundred and four. Don't pay for them. Five hundred. Only here alone. Only this place alone. Uh, half a thousand. And so, I so, I personally, I personally went to each poly unit. About thirty-seven poly units. They don't call the president. Yes, now. They don't call them. They don't call them. I personally went through over 30 police units and eight police units. They don't call it. Hey, for Plateau State, say now, say now, 400,000. Let me tell you something. This man has no brain at all. He's my brother, like I said. I will never, I will, the last thing that I will do is to deny Oraka. He's from coastal region and we are brother. But I want you people to know that the Amumu will never do. I will bring in Charlie Boy. Charlie Boy, that his mumu we never do. Charlie Boy said that he's the area father of wounded people. Or Basanjo told him that he is the father. <laughs> hey, oh, oh, Nigeria. I hate this country with passion. I have said it down with that number. If the power is in my hand, I will allow heaven to fall. If I have the power to command, I will let heaven fall. So let us end this word because I keep on asking myself. So we are going to be suffering like this till this year. Chukwokikabiyama will come. But we know that they are not coming. So we are going to be suffering like this till we die. Our generation will suffer till they die. And this world will continue like this. It's abomination. It's against humanity. And that is why we are telling our people to buckle their belt and embark on this journey of breath and restoration project. But our people won't hear. Because they want a good man. But we have told them that a good man cannot change anything. Being you a good man, it has nothing to do. We need your capability and sense of reasoning to be able to turn things upside down. But they can't. We are suffering. Let me bring you another one. <laughs> oh, these people, ndie, ndie, me go me ndie, me go me Which one is this? I want you people to see the, the, now they have already started their movement. They have started their movement of protest in Abuja. They say, Einek, keep your promise. Einek, keep your promise on their banners. I don't know what they are right against. Some people are saying that I make a, I make chairman should resign. Listen, let me ask you people something because some of you don't, some of you don't even understand. The damage has been done. There is no need of crying when the dice is off or when the head is off. There is no need of crying. 
the, uh, the, the result have already been announced. They have already announced the result. They have already getting the winner. Even though if you remove Ainek Shiaman now, Tinubu continues. What Tinubu will do, he will go there and pay the man, pay him off. Pay him, even though, pay him with, uh, even though he's, uh, what they call it, after you finish working, pension. He will pay him pension, join it. <laughs> now you understand. So this, this Ainek Shiaman, these people, he has, after they have announced the result, you has nothing. And I know that all of you as a youth, you are not going to do anything. You are just, Unupu, your words did not carry any water. Uno just now yap, talking all sort of rubbish, running like a lamajiri. You can't even see in northern part of Nigeria that a kid of three years is voting. You people will see it, you will not talk, and you are still waiting for P2B to win. People are coming from Chad, Niger, Mali, trooping into northern part of Nigeria to vote, and you are waiting for P2B to win. Are you are you are you are you okay at all? Are you okay at all? Are you reasoning at all? Oh, let us see their protest. I have told you as an Igbo man. Igbo man, putanoko, putanoko, ju. Sinoko, kariyama. Don't use your head, go and carry any protest. Don't use. Tell P2B to send his son to forward the, the, the protest. Don't go there. You are going to be there unless P2B son that is in England come back from England and stay in front of that protest. That is when you will join them. Don't even go there and use your life for nothing. Just go and prepare yourself. And come back. We are going to accept you. IPOB. That is the solution. We are going to accept you. But don't even you come and begin to tell us they are going to occupy this. There are some people in this struggle since years contributing. Doing everything possible to make sure that our people understand the root of their problem. Don't even come there at all. Now you understand what I'm saying. We are going to accept your people. There's no two way. That is only solution. For, her, for us to have one voice and one mind to be able to push. And when we push, we are going to get there. Now you understand. Let us see their protests. Let us see where they, what they are saying. <laughs> Nigeria is... <laughs> How many they are? Yes. 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 I next year man must be fired. How many are they? of Nigerian youths. Of course, when I'm saying all these kind of things, people will say, why can't you address these people in a manner of understanding? I can't. Because we have been lamenting from day one, telling them the root of their problem. But they don't want to listen. And now you want me to begin to console them. God forbid. God forbid. Which is what Gabriel forbid. They say the Ainek Shiaman must resign. And so what? If the man resigns, Tinubu is already your president. When these people supposed to start doing something, when they begin to delay. Wada Keshin Keshin, you are welcome to this wonderful program. Thank you, Wada. That is when they supposed to. Are they going to revolt? The answer is no. Are they going to go on a, on a, what they call it? Revolution? The answer is no. They say I next chairman must be must resign. And so what? And so fucking F what? If you resign, is he going to give you Obi? The answer is no. Obi is going to go to court and he waits thy kingdom come. Or next four years he will jump again. He will say he have taken a new strategy. Really, really. Wash their protest just. <laughs> He said their vote must count. Our vote must count. Our vote must count. Our vote must count. Our 
Our vote must canto, must canto. Our vote, Mbana Brago. Just yapping. Mbana Brago. Tinubu have buy everybody. Tinubu have finished everybody. You are there yapping, talking all sort of rubbish. Very soon they will bring military. All of you. Or small time, Kana, or Peter. Peter and Paul. On protest, they will begin to sing uh, Alingu. Oh, my people. Do you people watch Malaysia last time when they take over the parliament? Do you see any musician there? Do you see anybody playing guitar? You will see all these stupid Davido, them as not whiskey, the P square them. They will go there and begin to sing Alingu. In the in, in middle of protest, they begin to sing Alingu. Begin to dance. You see, you see in Ghana or Anna of flavor. On a, on a march like a king, the people are there you. You think that we are going there to do show? That is a protest. There is nothing like a show in protest. When you are going to protest, you are going there to pour out your anger. Do what you're supposed to do. Obey you are staging people, begin to sing. You, you leave protest that you, you are there to do. Begin to dance a lingo. Or you begin to see some people, hey, Davido is here, oh, hey, whiskey is here, and if his whiskey is there, and so what? And so fucking what? Who are they? They are nobody. These people are working for their pockets. Because I remember prayer answers. You see them, they are working, we are not going to agree. Okay, I'm in my pa, 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 all of them take off. They call some people as a musician, they settle them. They go and sit. Election will become the come. Now they have to do them, Ojoro. I want to know what they are going to do. Where is Peace Square then? Where are they? Are they going to sing again? The answer is no. Stupid non entities. Those that knows nothing. Cannot just use their common sense to reason. And know the mess they are into. Because they think that they are living fine. As an individual. But they have forgotten a collective we are suffering. Oh, let us go. Let us go. I still have a lot of things to talk about today. I know you people have mixed me for, for a while, but I'm here. I'm here. I'm here. I'm a family man. That is why. They are not paying me now. So why should I be coming here? Just I have to come, but this is it. Let me bring you people. What Onyo, let, Listen to what Onyendu said again. Iberima told you people to that he's going to force you people at his home. Let what, let's listen to Onyendu said about uh, Tifubu. No, about uh, 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 Obidat and uh, Articulated. Listen to what Onyendu said. I want you to people to pay attention. And the same thing, they are coming again to blame us. And we have said, what is constant in life is change. We are going to use our past mistake to correct the future. That is why we're here. We don't want to make the same mistake again. That is why when Onyendu come. If from Mamre uh, Madam Finance and Yushigazu, only her controlling the, the whole money of nation, it can never happen again. He cannot. Mazin Namdekan must sanction all his siblings. They should never double again in their life into IPOB affair. They cannot. Except that. I don't know yet. But if that thing continue, of course I'm going to go and sit down, sit my ass down. Because then that is when I will be knowing that what we're doing is a joke. We are not here for family business. We are not. And I know that when Oyendu will come out, he will make it clear. That is when you people will know who is their franchise. If I will continue in this path, that is when you will know. And I know by then you will shut your mouth up. You will know that I'm not a hero worshiper. You will know that I'm not a full full freedom fighter. Our leader is the highest commander and the director of Radio Biafra and the highest authority in this movement that we are. But there's a lot of things that have to be changed. I listened to my brother Kenga. A whole Mazin Nandi cannot travel to Kenya. None of the leadership knows the, the main one. Open the because uh, 
This one bring ten thousand dollars. These people bring, we give them position. That is why Madame Finance went to go and brought Kalura and Okora for with Obuefi, with German dog, with all of them, with Inkana Boshin and Kogene Bafia. He brought all of them. Who knows these people? Nobody knows them. I'm here, you know. Preaching the gospel of redemption to our people every single day. These people are traveling to zoo and coming back. And you are telling me, the, uh, can you tell me the work of Madame Finance? That she was last two days on broadcast on Facebook having a 25, uh, 25 uh, viewers. Okay. Let us listen to Onyendu. Pay attention, no? And I want you to go and call Ibenima for me. Ibenima, I, I, I will jail you. I will jail you. You don't know anything. Had we boycotted the elections, they would have blamed everything on us. <laughs> it is the cause of IPOB. That's why it will be lost. But we lifted it and delivered the entire Biafra land to IPOB. Knowing fully well that Fulani will say no. Are you listening? Only can state is more than the entire Biafra land put together. <laughs> the number of their yeah. That is what I'm saying. Mazin Namdi Khan is Shizoba of our time. I don't want to mention Moses or David. David Anna Baron on a Bible that he has a 300 wife and 1,000 concubine. You see how that man enjoyed. You see how that man enjoyed. And they will put it in the Bible telling you, hey, enjoy, have David did that uh, they send the, uh, one of his uh, friend to, 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 to go to war front because of no for if uh oh he didn't be fair their own Bible. Hey, people that came to our land and enslaved us for years, we walk in plantation for 400 years. They came back and tell you that slap me, I give you here. We bring you Jesus Christ and our Kyobu story. No sense to people everywhere. Now you understand. Our problem is religion. Mostly the people that find themselves in Biafra land. They believe that manna will fall from heaven. Now you understand. Let us finish listening to our leader. That is why we, we leave the election. That is why Mazishina Asamuru came and told you go and do whatever you feel like. That we cannot stop you. So that you won't blame us. And that is why we are happy today. Nobody blames us. You can never talk about your own. Or I can even do. Telling you that Nigeria is a evil. Am I the one that said it? No. It's Oraka. Oraka said that he will go and carry foam. They are going to destroy INEC. We are waiting. Blabbing. And it will see you. Just the waste words they are wasting words because they has nothing to offer they can't even stand christianity have destroyed our lives rojo i'm telling you the truth hey bukobi is there he will come tomorrow hey, god will do it raise your hand hey, hey, B will be restored hey, god have said it an accurate story some idiot will believe him Mbakana will come out now and begin to tell you the prophecy that I said uh, two years ago. I have come to pass. Uh, I told you people will be will not come. Oh, because Mbaka knows that what we know that it depends on the structure. The stru you see, let me tell you one thing. What we are saying is about the structure. The reason why we are telling you that an Igbo man in this five state they call Igbo speaking Biafra, like I said, I don't know uh, this a bony people. I don't know what they are saying. About the clicky people, I don't know. But we are one people. Mbaka knows the structure. That is why Mbaka will come out with this stupid prophecy. Telling you Peter can never be there. Are you mad? Who told you? Because they have already calculated how many lawmakers, how many local governments you have, how many states do you have. Even though Southeast 
and so-called South-South, we are, they have already divided us. If it's like we are one as a Eastern region, it could have been, we, you are going to be making some sense. In the North, they say they are one. In the West, they say they are one. When you come now in the East, they tell you you have to be divided. Now you see how they get our people. That is all this thing we have do. We have did the calculation and come back and tell you it can never work. If Obi get to that seat, Obi must compromise. Obi must abide with their stupid, concocted law. Without that, they are going to impeach Obi under 24 hours. And he must leave. Because they have the... The, the, the majority of lawmakers. Only do said this. Let us finish on you and the call. Only do continue, please. Wait. What is happening? Let me come back to them. Because I don't know what happens to this video now. What is happening? Is this video out? Nah, uh, what is happening with my network? I have network now. I have a uh, connected, good quality. And then, have they removed the video? Uh, if they remove the video, let me go to where I find the video. Let me. I will take the video from. From now, from um, from uh, from uh, where it is. Let me go and get the video. Let me get the video because we must get it. We are going to get it right. Okay, we are there. Let us. Not the elections, they would have blamed everything on us. It is the trust of IPOB. That's why it will be lost. But we lifted it and delivered the entire Biafra land. That is what we Knowing fully well that Fulani will say no. Only can state is more than the entire Biafra land put together. Are you the listening? Only can That's how foolish people are. Our people are foolish. Democracy is about establishing the will of the majority of the people. This is it. And In your case, the will of that very majority was trampled. Fervently disobeyed and disregarded. Yes. You are told that you are nothing. We are nothing. Returning officers, we are told the results to announce or else they will be held captive in perpetuity. I, I wish I wanted to show this video, but if President I President electoral problem. commissioners, we are held hostage on that gunpoint to falsify and announce fake results. Right. Oh, yeah, God bless you. She's all bang. She's all bang. She's Obama, Zinamde Kanu, she's Obama, my Lord. You are my Lord. Ebobu, she's Obama. You know all these things. Only Kanu State. Only Kanu State. The entire Biafra, they covered it. Only Kanu State. And our people are there shouting obedient. Obi is a boy. Of course, why Obi was there is for them to, they are coming to destroy what we have built. In a sense that a lot of people will go and join Obi. Why Obi himself know that it's not going to get there? Like I said, in a real sense of it, Obi won this election. But I said it also last time when I was telling people Obi have won. That is why you see whenever we're saying things, we don't make mistakes. I say Obi have won the election, but now wait for the rigging. The selection is coming now. And they have already selected. People are there yapping. Kinubu is your president. And there's nothing you can do about it. It's already there. Go to court. Now, court. No, be Tinubu go to postpone the court. No, be Tinubu. Is he not your president? Is he not Bugare that is in, in charge? They release only into Mazin Nandi Who is sitting on that chair that said that Mazin Nandi is not going to come out? Is he not the dead Bugare? The one that parading himself, a mask wearer. And now you think that Tinubu will get there. Tinubu is in charge. 
He is overall charge. You go to court, he bend it. If the judge wants to judge something, he, he resign him. He bring his own, as Bugari bring Tanku Mohammed. Now, this is how things roll, because we are not one people. We are not one people. That is why you have to understand what is playing. Our people, I don't know. Oh, <coughs> Igbo man, they say, they say Igbo man is a wise man. Na lie, na lie, na lie. No, no, not this generation we have. Only apart from IPOB. We, we are nothing. We are nothing. You say Fulani don't, don't know anything. Fulani is the one that coming to tell you what to do. He say, hey, Apoki, Apoki, Apoki. Idiots. Igbo man. Igbo man that don't want to learn. Let me show you your observers. They will bring, uh, they will bring uh, some people. Uh, they will tell you observers is here. Uh, some are coming from America. Some are coming from Britain. Some are coming from Germany. Observer. Observer now will come and tell you the election is not free and fair. And who are you talking to? Like I said, we never shy away from reality. We face reality. Nigeria was formed as a thread by part. But at the end, a one known entity called for a show. After Rod Rugard, Rugard have, you know, I'm a home and this woman in the night. I don't even know, believe you me. And they man, I tell you the truth. I want him to walk here and get a one 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 measure, make Korsia, put an auto to run out of Polena, Polena. That is exactly what happened. Rod Rugard, because he's a no kai kai, he's a drunkard. Rugard is a drunkard. Oh, would they go kai kai destroy you? We are like a Magnus Orak. Oh, would they go kai kai destroy you? We are. Where Magro this woman in? Maybe if any number of them, follow your money. Love and I'll get your canco. Or say, I listen. Rugard, this idiots that we see here that find themselves in this geographical entity, we are going to name them nigger. Rugard say yes. Because if Rugard say no, at the night it's not coming again. Or women and why they have power. Woman has power. I can't lie to you. There is a power in woman. Especially if you are in love. Now you are not coming in the night to Rugard say everything that you sense, you stamp it. That is how you become Nigerian. So we don't shy away from that. Nigeria is a sovereignty at this moment. We don't lie. They have already taken. That is why you see, after the observers will come and video, they may say whatever they want to say. He left for the Nigeria to do what they want to do. What they want to do. He left for them. He like you give the sanction. Who cares? Do you know how many barrels of oil they are going there every day? Even though it's better you give the sanction so that they will be selling the crude oil through black market. Because they want to enrich themselves. They want others to be poor. He bet Nigerian people will tell you, sanction us so that we are going to be selling on the ground. Come and buy you, take give me the money so that the Nigeria won't even understand, even though some percentage that is coming. That is it. Now let us see the observers. Oh, you both come, oh, oh, you both know, you both will marry here. Oh, you both will marry here. Ah, God, Chuku. Landlord, travel and see. Travel and see. If you travel, you will understand. Observer have come. We bring people from America. We bring people from Great Britain. They are coming. They won't try it. Will be no. Will be have gone to as no Amamehana. We are something number ten street. Will be have went there. Will be have seated on a round table. Will be have discussed. Nothing they happen. And I create a good story. What you is? You think full on this case? <laughs> <laughs> you and you and told the zoo call Nigeria to release him. Did they listen? The answer is no, because they know they will raise him, but this is damn they will release him. They have done what they want to do. They have finished their job with Mazen Namikan. Because I wish if Mazen Namikan was outside, and they because they know that. If you say that you want to do something, Mazin Namdekano can tell you what to do. And Nigeria will be, everybody will be running her task. That is why they keep him there. That is why they keep him there. Because they know that this is only man that people listen to. But Yorubao, 
Both the full and his alamajiri na abogari can put on. Both are also people. And our stupid non-entity Igbo people that don't knows nothing. Like the P2B. Now you understand. They are going to court. There is still hope because that is our people. We, we die say hope. When the dice is already hair off. Your head is on the floor. Now we, we say there is a hope. Manna will fall from heaven. Igbo man. Let us see the observers. <laughs> observers, so I got it. in Abuja, where uh, European Union election observers are giving their report on uh, the ongoing Nigeria election. What did they give? Uh, as regards making a difference, um, yeah. each election observation mission stands on its own merits. So we deployed here in early January and we began our process then. Yes. What Nevertheless, happened? our methodology means that we come back um sometimes within three or four years before we before we continue this thing we are saying before we, because you will hear what this uh, observer said but who cares you are telling nigeria but let us ask ourselves a question why these people have to come all the way from great britain from america from germany france to observe for what purpose for what purpose have you seen any delegate they sent to these people to observe their, their, their election? The answer is no. You know the reason why? We can't reason for ourselves. Our people are so daft and scorned that they can't even put one to one together to make something out of it. They are waiting for these people to give them reports. They are waiting what to come and tell them that this is free and fair election. They are waiting for white to come and tell them that uh, they leave the election. So that, and after they tell you they leave the election, what are you going to do? You are not going to do anything. They will pay these people their money, pay the everything they come. Then we go back. Then we go there and report. Uh, this, these people, they are animal. Let us forget about them. Let them just um, finish. Let us hear what the observer said. And you will tell me. If the Nigeria never announced their president, they have already announced it. Let us go to examine whether or not the previous missions, yes. um, conclusions, and recommendations are leading to actual implementation. And the previous mission came back a year ago. Yes. And examined the thirty recommendations and found that thirteen of them were either already implemented or partially implemented, okay. which is, I think, indicative that we do make a difference. That our efforts. Um, uh, serve to deepen the roots of democracy here in Nigeria, and we think it's a, the investment of time and expertise of our our, our core team, our long-term observers, yes. uh, is appreciated. And if there is criticism, it is received in the spirit in which it's given, which is a mutual respect and it and an insistence on on standards of democracy, which Nigeria already aligns itself to, and the standards that are contained in legislation here in Nigeria. Let us hear the other one. Go to him. Thank you so much, the yeah. chief observer. We'll take more questions if there are more questions. Just one here. Yes, please. Good afternoon. My name is Chema Kyle Carful. I work for Premium Times. I have a few questions. Um, first is to Mr. Andrews. You, in your speech, you made mention of lack of transparency and proper planning from INEC. I would like you to expatiate on that. And to the head of the EP delegation, talked about the instigation of violence and of course violence through the process on Saturday. Two questions there. Are you concerned about post-election violence? Did you get that? Post-election violence. And then secondly, uh, like your counterparts, the US and the UK, there's been a promise to yes. impose visa bans and sanctions on people who yeah, are like, um, culpable for don't instigating don't violence through this process. Are you also looking at that too for political parties or political actors who are found guilty? Thank you. Thank you very much for your question. On the transparency, um, one of the we, we, we first of all we acknowledge that I know wait wait to, wait please uh, my people wait wait this. wait my wife is calling me I have to call her back now just one minute it's very very important if my wife leave me now am I going to marry you and I copy your story and I copy your story in daily daily and I come over then I am on a come over answer your wife please I query I query daily daily hello bitte Neti ora ine. 
Now I will go around for that. Oh, she didn't tell her to put her daughter. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, let us go back to observer. <laughs> hey, uh, the observers. Let us go. We are going to finish. We, I want, I want to, I want to, I want us to listen to that what this man, that man replied. The man said truly that is the Abuja the with Shonan. transparency. Um, one of the we, we, we first of all we acknowledge that INAC had to. And of course, violence through the process on Saturday. Two questions there. Are you concerned about post election violence? Did you get that? Post election violence. And then, secondly, uh, like your counterparts, the US and the UK, there's been a promise to impose visa bans and sanctions on people who are found. But the um, Nugu have stopped traveling to America for years. What are, you going, who are you going to are you also looking at that too for? political parties or political actors who are found guilty. Thank you. Listen, Thank you very much for your question. On the transparency, um, one of the... We, we, first of all, we acknowledge that INAC had to um, conduct this election in challenging circumstances. Okay. Um, and we are, uh, are very conscious that the Electoral Act provides um, a very important legislative basis and framework yes. uh, that instilled a lot of trust um, in INEC in the run-up to the election Are you political participants and encourage many people to take part. Um, however, the publication of uh, figures in relation to uh, permanent voting cards and how they had been distributed across poll polling units was yeah. not made available. Okay. Uh, the They're information not made available. about the distribution of polling, uh, permanent voting cards uh, across states was made available uh, very late in the process, so okay. that it was very difficult for well, members listening? of the public here in Nigeria to verify or in any way audit uh, the accuracy of those PVC numbers. And clearly that goes to the transparency of the election, and it is an area uh, which, we, uh, we, which we have noted in our preliminary statement. I'll just mention, on, on, I'll let uh, Evan speak to the question that was directed to her on, on security in due course, but on visa bans, uh, the mandate of this mission is what is happening what is happening I don't know why this thing is stopping okay let us leave it here uh, an evil woman <laughs> one Nigeria or oh, one Nigeria now you understand what the the, the Oyibo said what they need they did not brought it to them in time there is rigging there is everything no straightforward. After uh, uh, you say they came from uh, uh, the woman say uh, Great Britain and America like a uh, like a Chuko Kikabia have come from heaven. After all these things, nothing will happen. Tinubu is your president. Let me go further before because uh, I have at least I have. Uh, let me see how many hours. Can somebody tell me how many hours have I used here, please? Please, I want to know how many hours have I have used. If I can uh, continue tomorrow, if I can finish it, let me show you people where no be. Nah, 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 here. See, see it here. Wale Shoyinkang published on March 7, 2021 by Ashoku Sunday. This is what uh, Wale Shoyinka said. Tinubu have also said the same thing before. He said Nigeria can never work. Wale Shoyinka said, Wale, Wale Shoyinka said, it's madness to think Nigeria will work. It's a madness. You must be mad if you think that Nigeria is going to work. You, are more, you must be an, a madman. That is Wale Shoyinka for you. He said it. Yeah. 2021. Can you see it? Let me show you when P2P Bugari is there telling you Bulaba, Bala Blue, Ewa, Gari, Moi Moi. We are going to give you Ewa, Gari Moi Moi. And, uh, and the P2P is there praying. See P2P praying. I want to show you people something. We love Nigeria.
That is why I told you people that Christianity have done a lot of evil to our people. They were giving you hope that you can see. They are giving you hope that you cannot see. God, we have put Nigeria into your hands. Come and take control. Zero hour. We are here. How will Peter be? And he kneeled down. He was on his knee. Why Bulaba? Balablu? Eh, Wadari is there sorting people out. Peter will be saying he's not going to go give shish. I begin to look with Peter will be. Have you forgotten about Nigeria? Peter will be went there in Anambra State. Begin to save money. Money that Peter will be supposed to use to build a seaport for us. International airport, our money. Oberuzi and Anambra, is it a problem? It's Anambra governor. You can build it in Anambra. Forget other states. If they don't want to build the, I don't want to support you, build it on Anambra. All of us will be using it. But the P2B is there. Saving money for Willie Obia not to come and squander. They say P2B tried. Tinubu, Lagos. Have you seen any school that built by Tinubu? Have you seen any infrastructure? Built by Tinubu or P2B or Atiku. Three of them have you seen any hospital when they were governor? Have you seen P2B anything or Papa for Ebana and Anubia? Have you seen any infrastructure that these people put in place as they are claiming they were a, 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 a highest commander of the state before? Have you seen any infrastructure they build? This hospital, this uh, this school, in the name of the good work they have done? No, not a, none of them. Tinubu is telling you because of their location, because now Lagos is a former capital, and they have built a lot of things there. Now they are taking more allocation, and he's expanding it. Go to Lagos, I stand Tinubu himself, build a, a road that one is for his own. For his, uh, this uh, bus that they are driving. It's his own. If you drive there, you have a problem. A, a, a country, you build a road for your own. You people are joke. Nigeria is a joke. Let us see Peter Obi. He's kneeling down. God is falling from heaven. <laughs> uh, uh. God, we have no Except this one. God deliver us. Okay. God free hey. us. <laughs> God liberate us. Hey. We have no other nation hey. except this one. God deliver us. Amen. God have delivered them. Things that you are going to face reality, practicalized things. God will fall from heaven and begin to do it. And God have done it for them. Isn't it? Let us continue. Let me quickly run to this. Uh, let me connect this dot. If I couldn't continue today, I will continue tomorrow. Let me bring this. Let us connect this dot. Let us connect this dot from um, Aloye Jimakon and this new picture. I told you people. It is only INEC. Is this. Mazi say it is only INEC. Can announce the result. So why are you wasting your time? The chairman of INEC is a fulani. Your Nigerian president is a fulani. Almost 99.9% .9 of lawmakers are fulani. Your police uh, highest ranker is a fulani. The commander of the army is a fulani. Navy is a fulani. Air Force is a full learning. How do you want to penetrate? How? How? If it's not Biafra, the solution. If it's not Biafra, the solution. How do you want to go? How do you want to go about it? How? Just to, if Peter will be entered there and do 24 hours, they will pitch you, you come out there. 24 hours. He must go away from there. Who is him? I want you people to see this picture we are seeing here. This is the picture that people are circulating about Mazin and Kukano. I want you people to pay attention to this photo very well. There is also one day 
the, the show where the Mazin and the can one was on a long course. They have many. I don't want to be bringing it here because this is the stupidity of people. People that are, are walking towards their own pocket. But when this picture was surfaced, this picture was surfaced before the election. Remember that last time we said that Mazin and the can they put, um, and I see standing on that, Mazin and Kano were poisoned. When Mazin and Woru came on uh, Facebook or on Twitter, handle everything, say that Mazin and Kano have been poisoned. Some idiot like Ezebiro and the rest of them, they came out, they said that uh, it's a lie. That Mazin and Kano is fine. And the one they call unfortunate in law and Unimam, you know, God will pion your horn. Said that Mazin Namdekano better remains in DSS dungeon than to release him. And that is exactly what is happening today. Because the doors are wise. These idiots and charlatans, known entities in Biafra land, and some was a bureau here in Germany with a Madame Finance, they plan all of them together. With Allah Yejimako, I keep on asking you a question. The day that I will descend on you, you will say that, hey guys, because I know you, you, if you try it, I have a lot of things, even though from America down to Biafra land. One day there, you come and you can never hear again. Allah Yejimako is a gossiper. On a quarrel. Allah Yejimako on a quarrel. If we who yourself, you man, you who are born a quarrel. Oh, then they are born, born, born a lawyer. On the other, a gaffe, a chopper, mad a chopper. Because he all masquerade called born a lawyer. Come and tell us what you because all this nonsense you you a real gossiper. Alo Ejimako is a gossiper. We said that Mazin Namdekan is sick and they need to take him to hospital. Mazin Namdekan said that when he's breathing, he's having some odor from his stomach. Mazin Namdekano said that when Ezebiro told our people that he is on mountain praying, that he wasn't on mountain, that he was in the hands of enemy. And the Anna Mam Mazin Namdekano, or Amam all Anna Mia in a day. Anna Queer Kakuboya. O Dolly's Ru Mazin Namdekano Nantiman Honorable Mazet at all, or Nano Dobo. Where are you who are saying that we are lying? They say that we are lying, that only do is fine. After they have collected money from uh, the politicians, they begin to surface some pictures. I want to tell you people what behind all these pictures. And, and when they were doing that, they were thinking that, like person like Mazishike, Mazishina Samoru, we came out and said that there will be no election. Then they will tell you, but you are saying there is no election, but this man is fine. Don't, can't you see him sitting on a gentle and smiling? Mazin Namdekano is dying slowly in DSS custody. We raise an alarm and so possibly telling us within Kenya, telling us that Mazin Namdekano is fine. Election is about to come and the one that come have gone. They begin to surface Mazin Namdekano picture that are all there. Now let us go to Aloy Ejimako to it. I don't lie, you see it here. This is a lawyer's Marco Twitter. We said that Mazin Namdekan, whenever he's talking, he's having some order from his stomach. That Mazin Namdekan have to see his doctor. They are telling us that we are lying. That anybody telling you that Mazin Namdekan have been poisoned, that the person is lying. That is what they are circulating, spreading. Because they know how to do propaganda. On the man they call their brother. Now you understand what I'm talking about. I know some of you won't like my preaching. Some of you have hated on me. But guess what? Who cares? Now pay attention to Aloy Ejimako. What is happening to Mazin Nandikano now? And tell me who are those that are fighting to release Mazin Nandikano. According to Aloy Ejimako... He said the today visitation with Mazin Namdekano included earlier today. He was in the clinic for an immune reaction that may require urgent surgery. 
He said that anybody doubting this directive should refer to the memo issued by his lawyer, especially the one by Paris and Nemeka on 15th December 2022. Now, they say that Onion Do now is in a clinic. Uh, but okay, instead of them to tell you hospital, now I want to ask you people, are they doing surgery in clinic? Is it in clinic that, oh God. You know why I'm saying all these things is for you people to know or to make this way So I want you people now to begin to connect the dots. When the Mazichina Sanguru came up, say that they poisoned the Mazin Namdekana. When we, the media warriors that follow in Mazin Namdekana and this movement of Biafran Restoration Project, and we came out and tell the world, they have to do something so quick so that Mazin Namdekana will survive. And the Mazin Namdekana said that, Allo uh, 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 Nemeka said that Mazin Namdekana is dying slowly. He said it. But the siblings of Mazin Namdeka and those bingos that are following them are coming to tell us, no, we are lying. Today, now, where is Mazin Namdeka? Let us begin to ask ourselves the truth. Allah Yejimako is a liar. Allah Yejimako is a liar. This man, on one hand, this Allah Yejimako is a apart from every day, he fly, pass by. He will run for forth and tell you. Do you know that uh, when you name Nayanya, Madam Finas was talking on Ike's uh, on her page, there's one fly that fly past the, the screen. I'm telling you, I don't lie. Open a hammer, the broadcast now, the broadcast caught. Hello, Ejimako, we run for forth and go and meet Onion Do. Mazi, do you know that when they were doing this broadcast, that this, uh, uh, that something happened, we couldn't hear? This is Asadon Ejako. Instead of the, I want to know now, is a lawyer Jimako part of the leadership or he is a, a, a legal representative of APOB or family one? So a lawyer Jimako now is the one announcing to us what we are going to do, like we don't have leadership. I am telling you people, but a lawyer Jimako, I will work with nothing because I will open chapter for him. I don't care. I will open chapter for him from America. From practicing his law, I will open a chapter for him. But now weapon I came with often. If only do send you a message, you go to the leadership and you stop this your nonsensical gossiping that you are going every single day. You go there to visit him, Mazen Namdekana. Mazen Namdekana have turned to 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 ABN and any and any. Is it what, why we are here? Is it why we are here, Lord Ejimakona Kwasre? You are a gossiper. You are a sea drug on mom, the one that will say it. I don't say cable. Oh, to more to hear the manager. You debe ziaho that because our money is with Madam Finance, a money of indigenous people of Biafra. Madam Finance said that uh, I think that we are going to talk about that one tomorrow. I'm coming tomorrow. A broadcast of Ike uh, Kunemen Kogirisini Abu Barista. I have told South African people, sue him to court. Kobeze Bia defend you, also no Barista. Ike Kunemen have run away. Where he's gossiping with uh, finance. Now they are gossiping with uh, our head of media. A man that gave us chance to be here today. The same as our former say that they are not going to come to Radio Biafra. Madam Finance is there gossiping, say Mars of them, I don't know when they, they, they started Radio Biaf. You see? Ike Chukwono cannot shun that idiot called Finance. He said they have opened a new account. So Madam Finance now is the one to announce her account. If Roshini Unu I have said it. <clears throat> I don't want to begin to say a lot of things. I'm just praying. Within these days after the election have already selected, I pray that Mazin Nandekan will be free. Then you people will know who I am. It's when I will stop on this issue I am. That is when you people will know that, yes, I am a full of freedom fight. I have said it time without number. The reason why I was not voicing like this before, because Mazin Nandekan was here. We don't see what is behind the Pangwan Tapa, but now we have saw everything. And I will keep on saying this. Without stopping. 
I think, let me see how many hours I have used. I told people to, to just put out, put it here if I'm going to continue tomorrow because if I overflock issue, our people will not understand what I'm saying because I think I'm going to do this thing, a, a, you know, a, a separate a separate broadcast so that it will get to our people because when you overflock issues, our people don't understand it. Let me just see how many hours I've used. I have already used two hours. Two hours, 19 minutes. We are going to start tomorrow. We are going to start tomorrow, my people. Great people, wonderful people, freedom fighters, lovers of freedom, great people all over the world. I greet you all once again today. We are going to continue tomorrow at the same time, one Tory, be afternoon time. We are going to start our preamble with uh, Ike Chukwu Onoha, with Madam Finasi Nanyushiga Mamre Azu. We are going to play their voice. We are going to tell our people the deceit. And anything that not come from Mazichi K, those they are all propaganda. But nevertheless, we are coming tomorrow. I salute you all, our audience, those that they are here. Obedient, like I said, plan B. Come, we are going to accept you, people. Plan B, second one. You and Igbo man don't join them in this their nonsensical revolution or protest. I don't know what they call it. At the end, it will Igbo will carry it. Use your brain. You are the businessman. They will go there and begin to stole your business. They will begin to destroy your market. They will begin to destroy your shops. Be wise. Use answers to learn. Because what is constant in life is change. You use your past mistake to correct the future. Use what happens to you in answers. Marazin Nam the Kano came to help the people to be able to rebreed them out from the shackles of the Luciferia they are. They turn and say that Marazin Nam the Kano destroyed their protest. Be wise. We are going to talk about the, the changing of new Naira. I thank you all for being here today. I salute you all, our audience. I think we get today also to 1.3K. Yes, we get there because I'm seeing 1.3K before it begin to go down. That to show you that we have already have our safer landing. And now at least when I finish this broadcast, in two days we'll see where he's going to be. Now I thank you all. And always salute our leader, Mazin Namdi Okuchu Kukano, who brought this ideology to us, who is still today in DSS Dungeon. And we keep on praying for him to come out very soon. Because he is Shizoba of our time. He is Shizoba of our time. And we are not going to shy away from that. Like I always tell my people, always believe it. Because whatever you believe will come to you. Biafra is our religion. Biafra is our way of life. Biafra is our identity. Biafra is the kingdom of Chukwoki Kabiyama. On this earth. Kese mi adenigwe, wa. Biafra land. Believe you me. Believe you me, I don't lie. But I know that it will be very, very difficult for you people to believe it. But they brought Bible to you now. Christianity, you grab it. After they kill you, massacre you. Before your mother, your father believe in Christianity. Don't you know that they kill us? Don't you know that they took us to slave enslavement for 400 years in plantation? Uh, this thing. So you don't know? Our people, we have to begin to go to the history the problem of our people, we don't know history. We don't know history. I thank you. Mazen Namdekan Mechuko Kiamema. Bless you. Lord, Lord, she she I will not say that I love you because if I say I love you, now they matter say because our people don't know what is love. They don't know what is agape love. They don't know. When you say now, they say, We love you. And for we, we love you. Because I don't know how these people are bringing propaganda, turning things upside down. Master Prophet, and they have forgotten that in our place, there are some things that we are using. They say, Idiot. That has no brain. Uh, I have told you this time with that number. You have been patient enough and you will keep on being patient 
uh, because we always ask you cookie kabia that promise us and send the Lamikano to us. If he knows that he's not going to fulfill this, why he send the Mazen Lamikano? Why is he suffering this man? I hope we begin to question who created us. I don't know, but uh, Chuko Kikabiyama is in his throne. We know that he has promised our leader, but we are saying that he has to come fast. Now they have finished their selection, election and selection. They have gone. We are now back again. Our people will receive sent if they can, because they have already bamboozled the minds of our people. Which HD, like I said, I will keep on praying for you, you and your kids, you and your husband, you and your family. Chukwoki Kabiyama will keep on protecting you people and giving you people wisdom and knowledge to be able to have that patience. Eyes water. Eyes water. Who do it? We know. We know. Person like me know very, very well. I'm a married man. I sleep and wake up with my, with my wife every day. I know how we feel pain. That is why when I see all this nonsensical, yapping and talking all sorts of rubbish, putting you in a place that you don't belong to, I always feel bad. And I always make this thing clear to every one of us. The same respect that I'm giving to Mazen Nambekano, the same thing that I'm giving to the wife of Mazen Nambekano. I salute you all to our audience. The doors are wise, Mazen Shike. Those of you are in charge on absent of our leader. We are waiting for our new, our new move because we are waiting for you people. The doors are wise, Mazen Shina Samuru, Mazo Forma, Maza Izayoba, Eke Oru Eke. Okay, for him. Eh, care go no there. Eh, Uno Budike Uno Budike Hapo Tana, I mean, I mean, I mean, Kori Uno Budike. And I want to use this opportunity also, this medium to greet the media warriors and our writers, the comment section. May God bless you all. We are going to see tomorrow. I'm coming back. We are going to analyze because time have gone. You see how many hours I'm here, talking, chatting, teaching our people, and at the same time using the comment section to learn. I thank you all, my people. Until we see you tomorrow, at the same time, 1 p.m., Biafra time. Remain blessed. I still remain your royal servant, Mazo Kenau Kichuku, known as the Biafra child in The general. They want to own them.